Hi, in this video, we're going to take a quick look on how to effectively search for information using Google Scholar. Google Scholar is a great place to get started with the research, as it offers a simple way to broadly search for scholarly literature ranging anywhere from academic articles to books. To begin a search, condense your topic into a concise group of keywords and enter them into the search bar. Considering how broad Google Scholar is as a search engine, chances are you'll get a lot of results from your initial search. With this in mind, it's usually a good idea to make sure the articles are being sorted by relevance. And, if recency is important, you can also narrow by the date of publication. If you find one article that fits your research needs really well, a great option going forward is to click Related Articles beneath the article's description. This is a helpful way to go from one good source to another and can save a lot of time in the searching process. If this doesn't work for you, you can also try the Cited By option, which will bring up a list of publications that cited the article you're interested in. From here, you can click a box at the top of the page that allows you to search exclusively within the results. As far as reading the actual article goes, a quick way to see whether or not we have access to it is to look for Full Text Utah State or other available PDF full text options to the right of the page. Be sure you sync your Google account with USC when searching from home where the Full Text at Utah State option won't pop up. Along with providing full text articles, another thing Google Scholar will show you a lot of the time is citations. These can be for a lot of things, from books to articles, but the main point is you won't get an option to click anywhere for full text. But don't let this stop your research process because, for example, books that the library owns aren't cataloged in Google Scholar. So a lot of the times if a citation for a book pops up, you can just search for it and find it in the library catalog on our website. Or if it's an article that's not showing up, you can use the information provided to request it through interlibrary loan. And last but not least, like most research databases, Google Scholar provides a quick and easy way to find citations for the information you found. Just click the quotes underneath the description. If you're still having a hard time finding good resources through Google Scholar, you can always try switching up your keywords. And if that doesn't help, feel free to contact a librarian.